in video description have provided the link to download free practice model please subscribe to this channel hi friends in this video we are going to see what is global access or vcs vcs is nothing but vehicle coordinate system for every vehicle in the automotive design has its own global access depending on that global access your parts are get assembled so while creating the air surface itself they will consider the global axis so global axis is the center center axis for the vehicle if whether it is a car or any commercial vehicles we will have we will use one more term named as working axis for the particular part we can create a working axis using the working axis we can update our understanding so just i made a sketch if you see the coordinate system for this vehicle is at 0 0 so whatever it is highlighting in white color it is the global axis or vehicle coordinate system so it is common for this full vehicle whatever the part extracting from the studio it is taking the global axis as the center of the vehicle so whenever we are going to create a new part for a npd work from studio we will use the start part trim start part in the trim start part they will have this global axis for the vehicle and working axis what are axis you are going to create on the part so just consider this is the front bumper and this is the windshield front windshield and this is the front hood area or bonnet area so whatever i have taken <coughs> consider as a a surface so this is our a surface this is our input <coughs> so while giving the a surface they will give the global axis whatever i am creating axis is called working axis it should be created on your part just for reference i am showing here and creating so depending upon this axis i will work on my part so this is for my convenience i am creating one more axis for this particular part but my global axis should be common for all the parts it is the reference part it is created on the 0 0 axis so i am just renaming it as a working axis for this bumper profile i am using this axis the working axis and the common axis is called as the global axis so most of the oems will use the start part so in the start part they will have the standard structure for their convenience in that one it will create it based on the global axis so default part will be located on the global axis itself so in automotive we we won't assemble the parts accordingly if you put the part in assembly by default it will be placed on the respective position because our a surface itself created from the location of the part where it needs to be assembled so i'm just creating a new part so in the new part consider this is the a surface conversion or creating the model from a to b so just an publication this surfaces so this is our studio surface how the studio tin will work that is what i have shown till now so now that publication they will take and they will place it on the module where it needs to be placed for so this 
obligation I have taken for the bumper part. So here I have the global axis and also the bumper profile. So just I have created. So next step is creating the volume for this bumper profile. So already I have created the global axis already exists from the studio surface. I am just going to create a one more axis that is my working axis. So whatever the feature or profile I am going to create it depends upon my working axis for this bumper part. If you have any doubt regarding this just make a comment. I can we can have the one to one session also to clarify this global axis and working access concept thanks for watching my video please subscribe to channel if you like this video in video description i have provided the link to download free practice model please subscribe to this channel